Hey guys, welcome back to Real Housewives Recaps. I'm so glad you're here. You guys, trending right now is Flop Gun Harry as well as Bunker Harry. We have so much to talk about. It's so funny. I can't stop laughing about it. Now, in case you missed it, we did go into in a separate video what's going on. Of course, the 21st annual Living Legends of Aviation uh, is coming up. Harold <laughs> of Harold and Fraud is slated to have have bought slash receive an award as you can imagine the internet is alight with funny memes and so i thought you know what let's just have some laughs so i've got my favorite co-pilot here with me to i don't know just enjoy the internet getting a kick out of this uh stolen valor of, from harry oh yes hello my flesh propeller is oscillating oh, God. oscillating Hey, this is Jay, also known as Dr. Bad Vibes. You can find me on YouTube and Twitch. I say things there, but today I'm saying things here about airplanes and awards, question mark. <laughs> yeah. Did you say flesh? I'm sorry, what was that again? My oscillating flesh propeller. Oh, don't say that again. <laughs> My built-in helicopter. <laughs> no, I don't know how to transition from that. So let's look at some of these memes, shall we? Yeah, so as you can imagine, people are going nuts with these memes. I'm cracking up about them, starting with this one shared by Lindy Lou Who, and it says, of course, Living Legends of Aviation. We have Harold practicing for his big boy award. Oh, here's one from somebody we know from According to Taz. Harry banking more flight time hours before his award show. <laughs> Oh yes, my favorite vehicle is the helicopter. It reminds me of myself. Because if I swing my hips oh, side to side faster <laughs> and faster, no. do you feel the breeze? No! <laughs> A funny side note I mentioned, or we mentioned in that other video, that Jay actually did practice for his pilot's license. And so people want to nominate Jay for this award because he might have more experience than Harry. <laughs> We joke, but the sad thing is, even though I didn't finish the license, I may legitimately have more experience than he does. Where's your award? I'll show you my helicopter. <laughs> Stop saying that. Also, where's your award? I need to wear a ridiculous dress that we can't afford. I need to claw under your arm. Get your award. Um, the only captain hat I have is uh, the, a paper one from Captain D's. That'll work. <laughs> and the Long John Silver's pirate hat. Great, and I'll wear a Burger King crown. Let's go. Yeah. Here's this one shared by Mon Petit Chou, and it says, recipient of the perpetually pissed off Pouty Pants Prince Award. That's hard to say. Uh, yeah, that's a great award for this doofus. Love the picture they included with it. Salty Duchess asks, will Bunker Harry be wearing all his Captain Xbox particip <laughs> participation medals when he attends the award ceremony he for his bought and paid award? <laughs> Flop gun Harry must be running out of space on his uniform. What? Uh <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. I love my Xbox. These are my achievements. I unlocked so many achievements. That's right. I think we just found your outfit for the award ceremony. It looks like somebody robbed a Boy Scout supply store and just slapped <laughs> all the badges on. I've made this before, this comparison, but he reminds me so much of Buster off of um, Arrested Development. Remember, Buster won all those, what, stuffed animals from the claw machine, and he said he won them at Army. Basically the same that Harry's doing. This was shared by Laird of the Manor, and it says, One of these men walked on the moon. The other is a whiz at Xbox. One deserved legi sorry, Living Legends of Aviation Award, and the other is a whiz at Xbox. Yes, love the joke, here for it. But does anybody else think, nah, he's not a whiz at Xbox. He's the one, he's like the little kid that you give a controller that's not hooked up to, right? And you let him play and let him think he's winning that way. We have this one from the Queen's Speech. Prince Harry's being awarded the... Legends, Legends in Pharmacology Award for his extensive use of pharmaceuticals. <laughs> yeah. So that's not too far off from what we talked about in the other video. I said maybe he deserved that award for chartering so many jets. <laughs> so yeah. this is just the natural extension of that. You know, if you if you have experience using something, maybe you deserve an award. Is he a legend in mommy's face cream? <laughs> oh god, oh. I am a legend of rubbing mommy's face cream on my oscillating torture. Yeah. 
Right. This one was shared by at Maggie Mob Rules, and it says, greetings from La La Land. But just take a look at the goofy, cartoonish Harry. Again, where's the difference? That's basically what he is anyway. And then the feet at the bottom of the plane, the cartoon. I, I love this one. From the official office of CB. I'm going to read it how... I'm going to read it how my brain translates it in the accent. Looks like Henry could do with some Red Bull. <laughs> because Red Bull gives you wings. <laughs> you get it. wings. Yes, I chugged the whole case of Red Bull. I just got, I didn't get wings, but it did make me oscillate. I believe I can fly. I will pay you to stop saying oscillate in that voice. All right, Prince and Princess of Wales X shared this one. Why have we got hundreds of videos of Prince William flying aircraft, but none of Prince Harry? Oh, that's right. He wasn't a pilot. They gave him the larger helicopter. <laughs> I didn't get, but a meager, worthy bird. I'm going to write a letter to King Paul. <laughs> Let's see. Kathy says, let's be honest. If Harry had been one of the Rat Brothers, they never would have flown. The only place Harry's a legend is, is in his own mind. He's definitely not a right brother. He seems to be the wrong brother. Oh, <laughs> Ooh, nice. sick, sick burn, bro. Love it. Laird of the Manor points out, I'm just going to leave this here. Prince Harry failed his pilot's exams three times. I also want to show this one, Salty Duchess, as well, referencing the failing his pilot's exam three times. But Mummy told him to draw his own box. Hashtag Flop Gun Harry. And then it says, that's one small step for a prince, one giant leap backwards for the truth. So we have this one from Kathy, who used one of the iconic scenes from Airplane with Harry's face superimposed on the pilot. I guess to illustrate what an actual chartered flight would be like with him, telling his boring stories over and over, just like in his book. I didn't get the big sausage. <laughs> Quit talking to me. We have lots with this here, this image, of course, from South Park. And um, yeah, celebrating flop gun Harry trending. I love this picture so much. That cartoon head and that is done so well. So from Lola Morris and the Princess of the Universe. That's a, that's a mighty fine title. Um, she caught footage of HH, the flying plane. <laughs> Doing his job at Montecito. Wow. My job is done. Once again, we have Salty Duchess with hashtag Prince Harry has been dumped from the Aspen Institute. I didn't know that. Have you guys heard this? I checked myself. He's not listed anywhere and nowhere to be found on their website. Prince Harry is a loser. Flop Gun Harry is starting 2024 by uh, failing in style. Hashtag Bunker Harry. This isn't flying. This is falling with style. I love it. It's Buzz and Woody, of course. Perfect. All right. You know, I love the Sidley twins. Nancy shared this one. Of course, flop gun. Great picture. Look at, look at Harold and Fraud in the background there. Well, I had to retweet it and I added. So I had to add grift into the frozen, frozen todger zone set to the song danger zone. Or should it be the bronzer zone? And then finally, we have Harry in a Halloween costume that he probably would have done a better <laughs> job with. Maybe he'll wear that to the awards. Maybe someone forced him to wear this one, but it's less offensive than the other ones. Oh, gosh. <laughs> but hey, that was fun. I like memes. I hope, you la I hope everybody had fun laughing at them, too. So if you want to hear more from me, uh, you can find me on YouTube, Dr. Bad Vibes, Dr. Bad Vibes Speaks, and twitch.tv slash Dr. Bad Vibes. Thanks, everybody, for following. I appreciate it. And I'm off to make some jokes. Yeah. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed it. It's just fun to see them go down like this. 2024 has been great. <laughs> and it's just getting better. So I'm here for it. Let's keep talking about it. Thank you guys for everything. I'll talk to you again soon. Bye-bye. Thank you.